Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. We're here for the infamous end sale. Um, I did place an order last night um, because things sell so quickly and it's just general card access. Um, and I noticed they're not really restocking as often as they did in the past. And I just don't want to wait for people to return items. So yeah, even though we placed or I placed an order last night, I'm still excited to go in and take a look to see what they have. So let's go in. So funny thing happened. Turned out I was supposed to RSVP to shop early, uh, which I did not do. So we have to come back at 10 when the store normally opens. And for now, we're just driving around. <laughs> Maybe get groceries or something. Um, yeah, so we'll go shopping in just about a bit. <laughs> Hopefully they have something left. Um, I, I looked through the entryway um, where the special event Congo is going on. Basically everyone who RSVP'd and there's so many people milling around the store. So um, yeah, 10 a.m. is definitely gonna be very interesting. <laughs> okay, so we're finally walking in. We're still about 10 minutes early. Um, hopefully they'll just let us in at this point. And we're in. I'm not really into Converse anymore. So not something I'm going for. Okay. Now we found the sale. So this is the Adidas collection, which I'm not into. Um, these are the ones I picked up online. And I love how light they are. I think I also picked this up. Definitely will not wear. <laughs> and these are the shoes everyone's going crazy for this year. It's definitely not my style. It's kind of hard to. I think this is more athleisure than actual working out. These are the Dolce Vitas. Everyone's going crazy about it. It's too shiny for my personal taste. So not going for these. I like these. Okay, so I did order these, Sam Edelman. Try them on. These are the Echo, which I love. Too. These are the boots everyone's going crazy about. I don't like the southwestern flare, so not going for these. These look cute, but again, don't like crocodile. Actually, these look much better in person than they do online. Um, I don't have the best of with Steve Madden, so I'm not sure I want to get these, but I do like them. Don't like BP. Yeah. So this is the prime shoe that everyone's crazy about. It's not for me though. I have slightly crooked feet. What do you have? Crooked feet. See, do you see how my foot's like coming out of it? Yeah, so it's not for me. And I do like them. I like the color combination this time. I like how they have like the brown here with the brown and brown. And this is the P448 collection they have left. <laughs> this does look better in person. So I'm going to try these. It's too shiny. So the p 448 They're kind of heavy though. I don't think I'm liking them half a size too big. So now I'm trying on Hall Green or something. I've never heard of this brand. But I love how it's all white. It's very comfortable. Yeah. And I size the half a size. But these are definitely my favorite. The Nikes I said I wanted, and the eight. Um, yeah. 
it's a white feet. I think the eight fits better. Okay, so these are some metal men. And these are those green ones I liked earlier. I think I'm still leaning more towards the green. I'm really liking these, I didn't think I would. They are surprisingly comfortable. And I like the gold bow on there. But I would probably size down to make sure your foot stays on. It's a little smaller than it's been in years past. They have a lot of the items that I was looking for. So I'm happy. A lot of this section, I think this is a really good value, especially if you like the magic cream. This is also a good set right here. It's basically like buy one, get one free. And not a fan of that color. Yeah, it's a pretty good set. These are mostly perfumes, which I'm allergic to, so definitely don't want those. I'm not a huge fan of these palettes anymore. It's online, but this is actually a really good set. It's what we have in our bathrooms. And um, actually, this is the same set that we like. <laughs> so this is perfect. It smells amazing. The throw is great. And it lasts, I would say, about six, seven months. So the, funny enough, those Paul Green shoes I was looking at, um, I ended up looking up online to just add it to my cart so we didn't have to carry the shoe boxes around. They ended up being $300. <laughs> and I don't know if I want to spend that much on a pair of just plain white shoes. I had my eye on this online. Let me take a look. The home items. Brady picked up the Nest Candles. That was such a good deal in my opinion. No, sorry, not the Nest Candle, the Nest Diffuser. Let's go look at the blankets. These are the Uggs, they're the dreams. I like this about the gay brand also. I like this, but I don't like this platform that it's on. I think it's just too bulky for our, our kitchen right now. As we know. I don't know if they had bedding on sale. We're looking for new bedding. I actually prefer the cotton over linen. There's some cotton. It's only 400 thread. So, I don't want that one. They have pillows, which we both desperately need, but these are king size. Not what we're looking for. So these are the Nordstrom Red blankets. I definitely recommend. They're only $30, very comfortable. We actually fight over this <laughs> during winter. Barefoot Dreams, I wasn't impressed by. Um, I will say this is double the size, double the price. Merge of the rack, but I don't find it that warm. And then I actually really love the Ugg ones. And I would definitely recommend Ugg, and they're actually, I think $30, $40 cheaper than the Barefoot Dreams. Fun. I actually wanted to get into gardening. This might be a good way. This is not real gardening, it's just like little herbs in our garden. But I'm really tempted to get this. Self-water into our garden. And now it's time for the clothes. I'll say that I feel like our nourishment is a little hectic. <laughs> it's really crowded. Yeah, he has no thoughts, but he agrees. <laughs> Okay, so we're done shopping the anniversary sale. You can see I'm really hot and sweaty. Um, in general, there like my store has nothing. Everything was um, empty from the hangers, and yeah. So we'll see what I actually even end up with with my online order. I will say that the sizes I ordered were very were probably not the right size. Um, now that I had a chance to try it on. Uh, for the cardigans, I would definitely say size down in pretty much every brand, if not size down one size, if not two. Um, funny enough, right now, I feel like you could probably skip Caslon. Uh, that's usually my go-to brand in the Nordstrom sale. But this time, the cardigans were really itchy. Um, the shirts looked like they were see-through, so I was not happy at all. Um, from what I can see, my location, I would say halogen was really popular. Um, the middle section for halogen 
was wiped clean. So not sure what I'm gonna end up with when they finally um, start pulling my items. Um, yeah, and we'll do a haul to show what we did pick up um, during the sale. I think you guys will be amused. <laughs> it's not your typical recommendations, basically. <laughs>